Hi, welcome to the channel. I had a fun day yesterday at an RZT at the Outpost in Sheffield, and it must be a good venue as it's my second consecutive event that I've done there. I've done a previous video about my list and how I focused on three Wraith Knights, and then I filled the rest out with Harley Quinns and a few HQs. It is a silly list, but is it also good? Let me give you a quick recap. My first game was against Death Watch, and a great opponent I've played and lost to before. I had first turn, but his army was very well hidden or in reserves, but I did manage to kill his chaplain on bike, which was nice. At least in his first turn he did show himself, but then he managed to kill one of my Wraith Knights with shooting and melee, which then promptly exploded and hit everything within 11 inches with d6 mortal wounds, which actually hurt me most as it was all my characters, really devastating my army, but hey ho. My shooting was good, but his reserves came in from crucial points to make a difference. My army was spread out, having so few models. My point scoring really impacted losing my Psyche and ended with a narrow loss for me, 63 to 68. That was a fair result, being honest. My second game was against Corn Demons with Bellicor and Scarbrand in reserves. I got first turn and took a win with 94 to 35. Shooting was the key difference and I held back to reduce the numbers before charging forward and getting both my knights into melee. Corn has some good abilities to reduce hit rolls and their demon saves in Narin AP is impactful. I managed to scream well so Scarbrand came in front of me, but he made the charge into a knight and in one hit dealed 22 wounds killing it, but this time it exploded and hurt him. Bellicor died without doing anything. My best moment was charging a wounded Scarbrand with a troop squad and killed him. I managed to take with the opponent by turn 4, so I think it was the lack of shooting that Korn had. My last game was against Death Guard. The Death Guard actually managed to hide really well and they had Death Shroud in reserve, but then got first turn and had to show themselves a bit. This gave me two first turn charges with my Wraith Knights, with the help of Strands of Fate Dice of course. Really devastating first turn for me and I was up in his grill. His reserves had to come on on his table edge to help out and that ruined his game plan. My Wraith Knights were key. It took a lot of firepower with him trying to take them out. In the end, I was killing lots and scoring well. Last couple of turns rattled through. Really fun game against a gorgeous army that won Best Painted and I won 97 to 35. Great opponents, great venue and a really fun day out. And I think that while my list did quite well and it was actually really fun to play, I don't think a three Wraith Knight list is that competitive. Shock. See you again soon. Bye.